Hello, everybody, and welcome to another episode of the Nikki Comic. That's right. I'm drinking food stamp beer on a champagne budget. As always, I come to you live, uh, totally smashed off my ass, uh, hoping I can ease myself into a transition. I've got my lovely assistant, Kathy, over here to add the shits and giggles. And yeah, she plays with my twig and berries. Um, <clears throat> Today, I'm drinking Miller. And I'm drinking brandy. Oh yeah, bitch. We gonna start doing it until I start going. Blah, 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 blah. And you're like, God, his tongue's kind of purple. It must be the blackberry brandy. Um, just a second. Let me take a drink. Oh. God damn, it's hard to get drunk on a fucking homeless guy's budget. Oh. Anyway. I was sitting there earlier talking about how our house is ghetto. My lovely, talented assistant, Queen QK, or as I call her, Queen Kitty, and anybody that likes me will call her Queen Kitty. Talked about how this wall was made of float meal. Yeah, see, we're poor. We get food stamps. Ba 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 ba. I'm loving it. And so we can't afford oatmeal, dude. Okay, we got to go for float meal, okay? It's like back when I was a kid and my grandma was like, what do you want for your birthday? And I'm like, I want Psykill from the GoBots. And she took me to TG&Y and got me a ro a what, what the fuck was it called? Uh, a Flowbot or some shit like that. It was, it was like 99 cents. Okay, we're talking GoBots were like four ninety nine came from Kmart. My grandma bought me a ninety nine cent Flowbot. Didn't even look like a car when it transformed. Looked like fucking some old lady's walker. Ugh. Today's decision. Will it be? I'm thinking it's the right hand of the devil. Everybody always says. Hold on. Got to roll me a smoke because y'all my fam and I got to keep this real. And this proves that I roll my own shit. See, dude, I'm telling you, man, freaking commodity butter, they need to bring that shit back for poor boys like me. Ugh. Dude, I got blueberry on my breath like something you wouldn't believe. It's like the Smurfs just like jerked off in my fucking mouth, which is gross, dude. Let me put it better. Smurfette just climaxed in my mouth. We ain't gonna have it like QK says it. Where spray on Vaseline is a necessity in this world. Okay, I'm going to bring this to you, and i got to say it, because QK brought it up, and it needs to be brought up. We got a coupon in the mail today, okay? Here it is, right here. <sighs> Shit. Uh, can you all read that? It says, save a dollar on spray on Vaseline. Okay, <laughs> like anybody can keep a straight face to that. When I make it big, I promise to swear to you that if y'all make me big like this, like I'm swearing, uh, for 
every show that I make over two thousand dollars I will send a case of spray on Vaseline to the winners penitentiary of their choice yes even women's because I mean they use like broom handles and mop handles QK's mama told me I mean QK's mama already talked to it about her uh, dude she been the she been dealing with the popo since fucking Christ had kittens, homeboy. Anyway, right hand of the devil. They always say it's best to be the right hand of the devil. In comparison to what? Comparison, comparison to the right hand of the chronic masturbator? Mm, you do a little evil, you touch dick all day. I prefer to go with the chronic, I mean, no, not with the chronic, uh, to go with the right hand of the devil and do evil all day. That's right. I want to be one of them guys sitting there telling them, telling their wife that their pants don't make their ass look fat. In truth, though, you got to understand, it is not the pants that make their ass look fat. The guys are being honest when they say that. It is their ass that makes their ass look fat. Queen B, mm -hmm. what do you got to say about that? Your, if your ass is fat, your ass is fat. The pants don't have anything to do with it. But they could get manatee gray though if they want to fill their hair. Manatee gray. Oh my God. Yeah, she just brought up some shit. TG, uh, fuck, yeah, TG, see, I'm stuck on food stamps, I'm telling you, man, my walls are made of oatmeal, and the pillars inside that are piecing it together are made of commodity cheese, I'm telling you, fucking, you could deep fry that shit and have yourself a sandwich, she brought up some shit to me, Target brought up this brand called Manatee Gray, which is referred to in nautical terms as a sea cow. Watch Family Guy, you will learn this shit. The thing about it is, is that fat people... You start making fun of me! Eating Twinkies! Um, sorry fat people, y'all know you're fat. Don't sue me, I'm poor. Um, but they went, some huge person, you know, you see them at Walmart. They're in one of those carts, rolling around, got some poor son of a bitch beside them, picking out their bonbons and Twinkies. I'm sorry, they ain't got Twinkies yet. Um, we're working on that. Got to keep people fat, right? They're working on their bonbons and, uh, fuck it, Chips Ahoy. Queen Bee, what do you say? Chips Ahoy? Mm -hmm. Yeah, Chips Ahoy. They, yeah, I'm introducing QK because she's got the shit. She's the reason why I keep doing this, because she says I can do it. And every time I tell her I can't, she staples a food stamp to my head. Says, do you remember this? And that's that brown and white piece of paper hanging from, yeah, I know what food stamps are. Uh, this brown and white piece of paper hanging from my head, and I'm like, dude, yeah, I got, I got to get back to doing this shit. But the right hand of the devil, chronic masturbator, I'd rather, you know, be the one touching you. Anyway, Manti Gray. It, okay, you need you all need to stop blaming fucking Target for making you fat. Like my little buddy next door said, if you can blame someplace for making you fat, then you could accuse fucking and I'm gonna give it out. 
And Volva Tube, you better hand me some beer, dude. Send it to my house. I'm living in Poplar Bluff. You know where I am. Fucking send me a message if you want me to fucking promote your shit. Miller, you do the same because obviously I'm promoting your shit. Send me fucking free 30 packs. Walmart promotes that shit. But the thing about it is some fat person somewhere sat and said, These people make me feel large as they're gorging their face with shit they ain't even paid for yet. Of course, they get food stamps because truthfully nobody but the U.S. government can feed these people. QK? Mm -hmm. See? She agrees too. See, my girl's medium build, but she know about them large bitches because they like related to me like half the country. That's why I got an eating problem. I start eating and then I think about Zsa Zsa Gavor being 90 something and throw up all over the place. Yep, that's my anorexia. But, yeah, that's right. I just picked a booger out my nose. Fuck y'all. I've been known to jerk off and hit myself in the eye and bloody my nose and black my eye. Fuck y'all. Yeah, that's a slippery little bitch when you coat it and spray on Vaseline. Um... DK, I mean, QK, what's the new news? That people are ugly. Your family's stupid. <laughs> Fat people are ugly. My family's stupid. Okay, fat people are ugly. I got to go on this because QK said it, and she's Queen Kitty. Queen Kitty, niggas. Get that shit straight. That is Queen Kitty. She is the queen of the pussy. She eats it too, so fuck y'all. Queen Kitty says fat people. Okay. You see them at Walmart. Don't deny it. You have to, like, get up against the aisle knocking shit off the shelves just so these fat motherfuckers can have some space. Because, let's be honest, they take up a planetary orbit. QK? Yeah. Yo. See, I gave her that because she Queen Kitty. <sighs> Damn, dude. If this was a joint, this would be so much better than what I'm smoking right now. Except for if it's Oregonian shit. Okay, let's be real. I smoked some Oregonian shit over in Oregon. Dude, there's something wrong about waking up high, okay? I fucking woke up high. That should never happen. You should sleep that shit off. Dude. I woke up with the munchies, everything spinning. And I lived in a, a house, honest to God, should have been condemned. But, you know what? No bad on her daddy. Her daddy was a cool motherfucker. Here's to you, Ralph. I'm drinking tonight in your honor. Kathy's father and one of my best friends. We give this to Ralph tonight. Everybody sees me take a drink. You need to take a drink with me. Spicy redneck style. Whew. Yeah, I may have long hair, but I talk about being a redneck. Oh, back to my family hates me. Because Q, Q K says it, 
and the queen always rules. My family this week has disowned me. Uh, good for you. I've never been a part of you, so... Hurt me, baby. Twist my nipples. They pride a pedophile over somebody that is about to be a professional comic. Y'all, please write to me. Subscribe, write to me. Tell me how you feel about people that, and I only mean this for people that have watched all my shows. Please tell me how you feel about people prizing a freaking registered sex offender. And I will say it because he has no rights once he fucking went to prison. James Patrick Despain. Look him up on Missouri Pet Predators. It will come up. They prize him over me. Like this dude Jeff Evans. These girls are always chasing after him. He beats on women. He uses them for money. And then when they're no longer of use to him, he tosses them to the side. Tell me how this guy, or James Patrick to Spain, is better than me. James to Spain rapes children. I ain't afraid to say it. I know it for sure he is. Jeff Evans in Poplar Bluff, Missouri, beats and chokes women. I had to fucking damn near break his wrist to keep him from choking this poor girl I know named Randy. Downtown by the fountain. Y'all, you know that I'm a comedian, but I always protect people. Tell me how these people are better than me. Back to the Manatee Gray. Think out. They sued Target swearing that Ooh. Getting kicked in the head a little bit. Um they swore that this was directly towards fat people. What? A, if you think you're fat, then why would you let the world know by focusing on the fact that somebody named something Manatee Gray? They didn't sue, they just demanded an apology. Fat people always want apologies. QK just said it. How are you going to sit there and say that Manatee Gray is pointing out fat people? Okay. They've got extra small that is in the same color, but one XXXX goddamn triple to the gazillion says Manatee Gray and these people in scooters scooter people you'll most likely find them at Walmart is sitting here saying that it's for fat people then the extra 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 large I mean extra 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 small people are considered fat too. What? You're not supposed to exist? Guarantee you that the wife of the CEO of Target 
is not one of these fucking scooter toting marshmallow eating fucking chips ahoy masturbating with fat people that QK brought up as an interesting point. This is Dorian, the neck iconic white, getting totally shit faced. To help you all out, and make your life seem a little bit simpler. Because let's be real, it's hard no matter what you do. Coming at you exclusively from. Fuck it, in August I'll be over in Reno. So, you know what? Whatever club I'm going to be in there, that's what promoted me. Fuck YouTube. I'm out. I love y'all. 1,533. Y'all think I'm funny. Everybody laughs. Love y'all. Peace.